Let's make a super easy summertime snack that everyone will enjoy and feel good about eating. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we gather together in the kitchen every single week. We create delicious and nutritious recipes to inspire you to make more meals at home. Today, we're going to be making a easy strawberry collagen almond energy bite. Let's begin today by adding one cup of roasted and salted mixed nuts of your choice to your food processor. Next, we're going to add in eight large pitted dates, which is about one cup worth if you need to measure out smaller size dates. One third of a cup of unsweetened coconut flakes. And now if you want to boost the nutrients in these energy bites, you can add in two scoops of our clean sourced collagens powder. Pulse your processor and then let it run until a sticky mixture begins to form. Now we're ready to add in one third of a cup of freeze dried strawberries, along with one quarter of a cup of dark chocolate chips or chunks. Pulse and process again until all of the ingredients come together. The longer you let it run, the smaller the pieces of strawberry and chocolate you will end up with. Now it's time to test your mixture by pressing between your fingers. If it doesn't stick together easily, then simply add in one to two tablespoons of water. Shape into your desired sized bites. I'm using a one and a half tablespoon cookie dough scooper just to make this easy. These super easy strawberry collagen bites are ready for a taste. These are fantastic. They're perfectly sweetened. I love the salted nuts in there. The strawberries are very, very slight. So if you wanted to add in more of that flavor, you certainly can. And there's also some optional spices you can add. You could add in one eighth a teaspoon of cayenne pepper for just a little bit more spiciness, goodness. <laughs> and you could also add in one half of a teaspoon of Ceylon cinnamon. I mixed those spices in last minute and I tried it both ways. I definitely liked the spices better. And if you don't like cayenne pepper, just do the cinnamon. I think it makes a great, beautiful <laughs> difference in the taste. These are so fun and I think the whole family will enjoy them. Give them a try. Thanks so much for joining me today. Hey, here's sending you and your loved ones so much health this week, and I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.